It's time now to ask the analyst using the hashtag 7 Sports Cave on Twitter. We've been scouring. You know, Mike Foss, sports producer Mike yeah. Foss, he's a big fan of wrestling. He was oh. at the pro wrestling last tournament. Last Saturday? Yeah, no, last night I think it was. Yeah. Is Hulk Hogan still wrestling? Or no, no, no. They, Undertaker? That's a whole other story. He's he's kind of not a thing anymore. Oh, he's but not that's a, a thing whole, anymore. That's a whole other topic for a different day. Did you see the uh, movie? Much tr- more uh, important, though, before we get into Twitter, I want to give a quick shout out to John Bonamago. CMU football head coach uh, just finished his last treatment for tonsil cancer on Friday. Uh, you see the video. He's ringing the bell in Ann Arbor to signify his final treatment. And uh, Brad Galley and I got to spend some time with him Friday in Mount Pleasant. Incredibly inspirational, this guy. Everything he's going through as he gets ready for the season. Uh, Brad's put together a pretty, pretty great piece on it. Uh, it's going to air Tuesday night. You definitely do not want to miss that one. Great, great story. Great guy. Uh, we had a good time with him on Friday. So anyway, let's get to what the people are saying this morning. As usual, when the Lions are the topic of discussion, it is a very popular topic of discussion. Sean says he hopes Abdullah can start week one every down back who can do it all. He is going to be a fantasy stud. Travis said George Wynn is definitely in danger of getting cut and along the same lines. Ray says Wynn is great. But if Zach Zenner doesn't make the team, it is a travesty. Jeff says RG3 and the Redskins O-line are terrible. We'll see what the Lions defense does against a top offense before they draw any conclusions. And finally, Bob says the Lions preseason games are what (laughs) Wednesday practice rounds are to the PGA Tour meaningless in the record books. Guys? Yeah, Bob, you still got to work on my downswing. We worked on the backswing, but now we got to work on the downswing. So preseason, like two games through is here. We got game three and game four. He's right. Yeah, he is absolutely right. But, but. You know, I think that it's important. Zach Zunner makes the team as well. But if you're, not, you pay well, more attention to win in, in the special teams than I have before. So well, I'm, I'm just saying he's, he's a really good special teams player, and that's why he probably made the team last year, and that's why he might make the team this year. I think we get caught up every year in some training camp phenom, and it's usually somebody who's only going to be basically a fourth-string player anyway. Yeah, sure. it'd be nice if he makes the team, but I don't think it's going to make that much of a difference. But isn't he a guy that can not only do it for you on the special teams? He's got the he's got the build for it. He's got the build to be you know an up back and maybe block a little bit and, and do those types of things. But at the same time, you can find a way. I mean, this team doesn't need him to do that. I think that's probably the well. Difference. It also depends on the health of Joyke Bell. Ah. Joyke Bell is you know shaken up, and they will need another running back. He probably well, his his week one status is in serious serious jeopardy. And so's Haloti Nada. I mean, we're true. talking about their defense. Let's be honest here. That, that the tweeter was right. They haven't played against really a, a top notch offense. Yep. And even in the Jets game, you saw the way Chris Ivory was running through that defensive line like yep. like butter. Uh, if Nada doesn't get there soon, they're in trouble. J E T S Jets Jets Jets. No, they're terrible. Yeah. All right, coming up next, the Prep Kickoff Classic. What, what was the shake with the camera for? <laughs> Dancing to the Jets. Too. Absolutely. We got a couple of special guests. They're right over there. Give them, give them some love. There they are. Cast Tech in the house. We'll be talking to them very next here on the Suburban Ford Seven Sports Cable.